Hi, new coaches, and welcome to your Getting Started Right training. This training is going to tell you everything that you need to know to get started. I'm going to help you learn everything you need to know to get started. Those are the key words. I'm not here to overwhelm you or to give you nine million things that you have to learn in five days. That's not what this is about at all. There are certain things that you have to know in order to get started as a coach. There are lots of things you need to know, but you don't have to know them all at once. You don't have to learn everything in your first couple of weeks as a coach. So just to give you a brief overview of how this works, I've broken down my new coach training into a couple of different stages. First, you'll do the getting started right. Then you'll do the new coach training, which is just a little more advanced. Then you'll do an emerald training, then a diamond training. All of these are broken down into stages so that you are taught what you need to know to be successful where you're at in this business. And that way you're not spending a lot of time learning things that you really don't have to know right now. So right now we're going to focus on the things that you have to know to get going. The very, very first thing though that I want to share with you is you absolutely must be a product of the products. You have to be Drinking Shakeology, I mean, it's not a requirement. This is just my opinion. You need to be drinking Shakeology. You cannot sell things to someone if you don't know what it is going to do for them. You need to have your own success stories. You need to have your own benefits to tell people of the products. You don't have to be at your fitness level. I'm not at my fitness level that I want to be at yet. You don't have to be the size you want to be in order to be a coach, but you need to be on your journey. You have to be working towards that goal. You need to be doing some sort of a challenge group, some sort of a challenge package. You need to be on the product. You need to be living the lifestyle. And that's the most important thing as a coach, because if not, you're not going to instill any sort of trust and confidence in other people that the products work and the programs work because if they just wanted to hear success stories from other people, they would go to the Beachbody website and just order or they could order from the television programs, you know, the as seen on TV things with the P90X. They don't want that. They want somebody to tell them, Hey, I'm a real person. I'm just like you. This is what I'm doing. This is how it's making me feel. These are the results that I've seen so far. These are the victories I've had so far. They want that. That's why Beachbody works so well, because they have a coach, they have a challenge group, and those things are absolutely vital to their success. So you're never going to be successful as a coach if you're trying to coach challengers when you have no idea what a challenge is about yourself. So definitely be working on yourself and be a product of the product be incorporating this lifestyle into yours if you haven't already done that. And that is the absolute most important thing you can do to be a successful coach. Now, I'm going to share with you some basic things here. And I'm going to sign out of that and do something new. The most basic thing that you need to understand is your coach online office. To get there, you go to www.teambeachbody.com. That's it. And my internet's going to choose to be really slow. Okay, here we go. I'm going to sign in. And all of you most likely you know, should have sign-in credentials because typically if you're one of my coaches, you were already one of my customers to start with. 
So you already have a Beachbody account. That's what you sign in with. Okay, here you go. The very first thing that you need to do as a coach is go to your profile. Now, there's two reasons for this. The first reason is because when you go to basic information, which I'm clicking on here, this right here, the screen name that you choose, choose it wisely because when you direct someone to your Beachbody website, that is what they are going to be using. Your link will be www.teambeachbody.com slash whatever your screen name is. So mine is Taryn Hobbs. Easy peasy, easy to remember. Definitely do that. Fill out as much of this as you can in your profile because, and you won't understand this yet, but that's okay. Just know it's important because when you get to the point in your business that you have hit certain parameters and certain goals, Team Beachbody will give you free leads. Basically, they're giving you free customers who are ordering Shakeology or programs or things like that. But one of the requirements to get leads is that your profile be filled out. So that's the very first thing you should start with. After that, you're gonna hover over coach and you'll see coach online office. That's where we want to go right now. This is your hub of your business. This is everything you need to know. Over here is your coach ID. If you don't memorize it, at least know where to find it because you're going to come across a great many times where you have to put in your coach ID. So you definitely need to remember that. Your current rank as a new coach is just going to be coach. And as you progress in your business, then that will change. We'll discuss all of that later. I don't want to overwhelm anybody. This little section right here, this can be incredibly confusing to people at first. I don't want you to focus on those numbers right now. Don't focus on that whatsoever. All you need to understand is that the success club points are awarded for things that you sell. And your goal as a new coach is just simply to reach five in a month. I've not reached my goal yet, which that's incorrect because it takes a while for it to update. So mine's actually higher due to some activity I had last night. But so also don't freak out if you have a customer purchase a challenge pack and your success club points don't change. Just make sure that they are correct by the last day of the month. And if they're not correct, then let me know and I'll teach you how to contact Beachbody about that. Over here, there's a lot of stuff that you do not need to understand today. Today, you just need to know how to navigate this. You need to start here. When you're doing this on your own today, I want you to start here. You want to read this from Carl Deichler. Deichler, I'm sorry. You want to click on how to get started. And these are the steps to start you off right. The business quick start guide is incredibly important and you need to print that off and you need to start filling things out. So I want to tell you quickly how to do that. Your coach ID, we just went over that. If you go back to your homepage, always takes you to that coach online office homepage. Your coach ID is right up here in the corner. So you need to know that, write that down. Your websites are going to be, this one, the Beachbody, um, all of these right here. Let me show you here. 
your website. You have several different websites. So let's say this is your coach website. I'll be honest, I don't use these all that often, but you can. And in order to find what they are, it's right here. Your site URL is right here. You can edit this and you can check this out and see you know, what it's gonna be useful for to you. The main one I use is my main website, and I have used the Shakeology website several times. If I have a customer who is interested in Shakeology, I share with them about the benefits and I share with them the basics of what it is, and then I may send them to my website. You know, if I have customers who just want Shakeology and they don't want a challenge pack right now because I have a couple of customers that are just on Shakeology, I send them to this. But this is how you find your website URLs. So you'll fill those in. This way, you will have this and you will be ready to go. What I suggest is after you print off your business quick start guide, I suggest you purchase a cheap binder. Um, maybe an inch for right now would be just fine. Purchase a cheap binder from Walmart or the dollar store and put this in your binder. This is super important information that you are going to use very frequently. So your coach support team, your sponsor coach is me, your diamond coach is Mandy Abney, and your star diamond coach is Mandy Abney. These numbers are very important right here. Coach relations, if you ever have an issue or you ever have a customer who has an issue with anything, coach relations is the number that you're going to want to call or want to give them. However, I very rarely call coach relations. Instead, I use this. This is like emailing them and it's much faster, much easier. That's what I use, but now you have it right here so that you can reach anybody that you need. Here are some great things to follow depending on what you do on Facebook. This is a coach page on Instagram, YouTube, all of those things. Now the national wake up call, I will admit I miss this frequently at the actual time it occurs, but I do very often go back and listen to it later. You can play it back by phone right here. It's a super awesome call and I really, really think that it is very important, especially for new coaches, to stay up to date. It has so much motivation, so many great tips, and so many things that are very important. So I always add that into my week that I'm going to listen to that call at some point. Now, how to set up your, or what to do to set up your business is next. How to set up your profile and websites video. You're gonna click this. Now, like I said, I think you should print this off, but a lot of these things you actually need to do when you're on the page, so you can click on it. It will tell you, this video will show you how to set up your profile and your websites. How to navigate the coach office. The value of Team Beachbody Club is right here. Now, create an action plan. That is page two. Identify people to help. These are people that you already know and you already have a relationship with. As a new coach, you're gonna have a lot of people in what we call your warm market. They're people that already trust you, already know you, and are already going to be very receptive to what you have to share with them. So try to think, use these memory joggers and contact lists, and try to think of all the people that you want to help. And something that I've learned, don't discriminate, and I don't mean that in a bad way, but don't look at people. A lot of times new coaches will think, I only need to reach out to the people I know who want to lose weight 
or who are overweight and need to lose weight. And you will learn very quickly that that is not at all what you need to be doing. Don't discriminate based on if you think someone can afford it or not, or if you think someone needs it or not, or if they want it or not. You would be amazed at how many people you would think wouldn't be interested really are. People who just want to tone up, even if they have no weight to lose. People who want a healthier lifestyle, even if they have no weight to lose. It's absolutely amazing because there's so many times that I would prejudge someone and think, I know their financial situation. They're not going to want to do this. Or I know that they don't like to spend money on things like this. So they're not going to want to do this. Then I turn around and I see them added in challenge groups by other coaches because those coaches did not prejudge. They reached out to anybody and everybody that they thought could identify with them and would like to hear about our products and what we can offer. So I've learned a long time ago not to prejudge people and to share this with everyone that I know. And it may or may not be for them. So just keep that in mind when you do that. The four vital behaviors of a coach, this is super important and it's something that you need to like totally drill into your memory. Okay, invite, invite, invite. You cannot say that enough. In Beachbody as a coach, you need to be inviting people every single day. It's up to you how many people you want to invite and I tend to vary mine based on what I have to offer at that time. You know, if I have a free challenge group, I will invite every person I can possibly message. If not, I try to make it 5, 10, 15, or 20 people in a day. Right now, you have a warm market, so invite a lot of people. After a while, you won't have so much of a warm market, and that's why you'll be developing new relationships, and we'll share more about that later. But you need to invite people, and um, I will share some of the messages that I send Although, if you are one of my new coaches, you most likely got started with a message from me. So you know kind of what I send to people. Focus on their goals. Don't just invite and say, hey, I got a challenge group. Do you want to be in it? You know, share that with them, of course. But talk to them and find out what their goals are. Do they want to lose weight? How much weight do they want to lose? Do they want to be stronger? Do they want to be more toned? Do they have a certain size they want to reach? And the most important thing is to find out why they want to do that. When you identify their motivation for wanting to be in a challenge group potentially or a coach or something like that, that is going to be such a much better conversation because they're gonna see that you're not trying to sell them a product to make money. You are trying to share something that you're passionate about and you want them to have what you have. So talk more about them and less about you and the products and that will make for a much more successful conversation. Be proof the products work. We already talked about that. Do personal development. Personal development is reading things that are going to help you work on yourself in some way, whether it's your self-confidence or um, learning how to manage your time or anything like that. You don't want to only focus on your nutrition and your fitness. If you're trying to create a healthier lifestyle, you also want a mentally and emotionally healthier lifestyle as well. And reading certain personal development books will help with that and it will also help with your business. And I will share with you some of the books that I've read that I find to be very helpful. Recognize, recognize, recognize. Get excited about every milestone that you reach. Every time you help someone, every time you help somebody, you know, every time they get a challenge pack and they lose a couple of pounds, 
every time you get a message from someone saying, hey, I'm so happy you reached out to me because I'm just absolutely at the end of my rope and I have to make a, diff you know, a difference in my life and a change, celebrate that. Be excited about that. And it doesn't matter how small it may seem to other people. Any victory for people you're helping is a major victory for you. It is the most fulfilling thing ever to start getting those messages from your challengers that you're helping to change their life. I promise you. So engage in training. We're already going through that right now. Review your coach basics, participant starter guide, review coach training, review leadership ladder. Um, you can look through all of those things. And in fact, I suggest you do. Now you're going to do your coach action plan. Your success partner can be a spouse or it can be me. It can be a best friend, someone who's going to work with you together. These are pretty self-explanatory, but what I want to tell you here is that for the first three months, you want your goals for success club to be five. You want to hit success club five each month. You want for the first month, two months, three months, your minimum goal needs to be to earn enough to pay for your psychology. If you want to set a higher goal for month two and three, that's wonderful. But month one, you're going to be focused on learning this business. And remember, we have told you, you know, time and time again, this is not a get rich quick. So don't put a thousand dollars for month two, because while it probably can be done, it's probably not going to be done. So don't set your goals too high and get disappointed. Be realistic. Rank advancement, you really want to hit Emerald by your second month because that is when you start earning more money. When you're a coach, you earn commission and that's it, which is fine. You know, you earn 25% off of everything that you sell. So any challenge pack, anything like that, you earn 25%, which is wonderful. But... When you hit Emerald, you also start getting uh, team cycle bonuses, and that is where the majority of coaches' checks come from. So you really want to get to Emerald as quickly as you can, and we will discuss that later, but make that your goal. I want you to complete this. Then I want you to go back to how to get started. You've already joined the group that you need to be in. I want you to go through this entire section and read over it, and I want you to do the site tour. That is your assignment for today, and I will reiterate that, but today's assignment is to set up your profile on Team Beachbody, to edit your websites, and to go to the start here and go through each one of these. And I want you to go through the getting started right. And you don't have to have that done by tonight. I'm sorry, I clicked on the wrong thing. I don't want you to get that done tonight, by tonight. But that has to be completed by the end of this five-day training because we're going to have a call, a one-on-one -on -one call, and discuss it together. So I want you to go through that. And let me go back here so that you see. Click on the CEO welcome, read this. Click on how to get started and go through each one of these steps. All right. So that is what I want you to do for today. That's a wealth of information. It's a lot of wonderful things and you need to have it. So I want you to take your time and I want you to go through all of that. And then when you have completed it, I want you to comment with done on this video. And I also want you to ask me any questions that you have from anything that you've gone through today. So have a great time getting to know your online office and filling out that getting started right. See you guys tomorrow.